guys welcome to another exciting time on gusto news my name of course is ife olua and just me today in the news with me is Bonnie boy and big wiz yeah i got the grammy boys in the news today yeah, yeah. and as all well, of a legend in nigerian music industry especially when we talk about rap that's no other than mi abaga but definitely yes before i go on i'd like to say thank you to you guys for the likes for comments for telling people about gusto tv please keep doing so and yes if you're new to this channel please click on the subscribe button and as well just take a, you know, a step further and click on the notification bell so when our content drop you get to see it at the snap of finger yep yeah starting off this news with Bonner boy and whiskey yes of course you know these two guys happens to be one of the biggest things who've happened to nigerian music and even nigeria as a country yes a lot of people were excited because you know both of them are grammy award winner Bonner boy won you know for um a solo yes as a solo winner of grammy award they just concluded one for world album category and for whiskey um one alongside beyonce for you know the video of brown skin girl so yes both of them are Grammy Award winners, and yes, we've seen them do their thing together. Of course, we saw um, one of the songs of Whiskey Made in Lagos album, Ginger. He had um, Bonner Boy on that one, and of course, um, the video is amazing, amazing to watch. You know, the, the way they were able to come together and all of that is you know, one of those things we love to see. Yeah, well, this guy is at the moment, we know that twice the store album still doing very well. Although, yeah, Bonner Boy seems to be moving away from it. But, of course, that's a Grammy Award winning album, yeah. And for Made in Lagos, trust me, Made in Lagos at the moment has been getting decent certification from different people saying the album is pure fire this one this other person saying it's one of the best of all times and all of that yes but these two people seem to be moving on you know whiskey as well said something is coming up in the next seven days and we are expecting that one yes but there's a video making rounds online and both of them whiskey and um Bonaboy could see both of them and this video seemed like a video shoot and can see someone seem like a director you know trying to direct them you know a group of people behind them like probably a vixen or something but we don't know what they're working on could it be maybe announcing a partnership with a brand or both of them are just coming up with a new song and they want to just drop the video with it asap because yeah whiskey is here it's not somebody we see on a daily basis yeah so yeah everybody is excited about this one the video has been going you know, different blogs sharing it you know even fans have been put up the IG story say what are we expecting what is cooking yeah whiskey fc outsiders you know i mean these guys are coming together and we're excited about this one because we've seen them you know done amazing things as solo artists and coming together to work as well we can see that as an evidence on ginger so trust me whatever it is whiskey and Bonner boy is up to it's something that would definitely blow us away <sighs> yes moving on the news of this one is um am i a bag of course you know that when you talk about those people that makes rap still you know as much as afrobeat is a thing in nigeria emma is one of those people that i still will say when you drop something you just want to listen been in the industry worked with amazing people got amazing body of work that speaks for him and of course most recently on he dropped alongside one of the youngest in the music industry at the moment and trust me that one is of course a hit well in an interview with a media house here in nigeria i went on to talk about you know the song and talking about the artist he worked on uh, on that one he went on to talk about the song of course am i featuring oxlade and that one is called all my life yes i talked about the fact how oxlade is an exceptional singer he missed an opportunity of signing him on but he's glad to see how much has been growing you know over the years and of course you know um ice prince who happens to be you know one of the guys uh, with emma lungs you know remember chocolate city guys in the past i also have a song colo with oxlade that's to tell that it seemed like oxlade have something to do with the rappers yeah but yes, he has also went on to say that, uh, I mean, talked about the likes of Black Moon saying, you know, he's also an amazing singer. But one thing that stood out in this interview, and a lot of people um, as well have gone on to say, okay, yes, this is good for the Nigerian music. It's not every time, you know, we're going to see our artists not being in good terms and all of that. So he went on to talk about the likes of Fireboy, you know, Oxlade, um, Joe Boy, a couple of them, yes, how these guys are actually able to relate well. He loves the relationship between them, that music should be, you know, means to reflect unity and love and, you know, happiness. And so for him, this 
crop of youngies in the Nigerian music industry have been able to, you know, do that by relating well with each other. We see them together, they feature each other and songs, and you know, they support each other. When one person releases, others, you know, just seem to be posting and say, Oh, go run up this, my brother got this, my brother got this, and that's to tell that I mean there's love um you know amongst these guys, and we just hope that it continues like this. We don't want it to be a thing of the past. We hope that you know by the time we sit to talk about oh these guys have been in the industry for probably a decade we want to talk about them still having good relationship with others in the industry it's a good way to put music out and of course it reflects nigerian music industry as you know place where there's love and unity amongst those you know running the industry yes but of course you guys we're here to give you guys any update on that one what bono boy and whiskey is up to once they let us know we'll be here to give you guys that update and what do you think about you know the young guys in the industry now their relationship how long do you think it will last tell us on the comments section and we'll just be right there to respond to you see you and next one yes yeah, stay safe bye